Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another episode of TAPS, the totally accurate battle simulator. Now in the first episode I kind of had to learn what the game is all about. So this, we are gonna take a look at the campaign and we're gonna see if we can come up with something fun. So I'm not really sure like what is the best way to start this. So I was just thinking a collection of fun and interesting levels for the adventure maybe. We haven't played through this yet. So it looks like we're gonna have all of the ages which we covered so far but maybe the the scenarios or the settings are gonna be a bit more challenging or more fun so holy fudgesicle you can actually put your guys on top of the trees no freaking way that is so cool and hold on it, it looks like we can actually switch between all the units so like wow there is just so much stuff which we can choose here from like we have spooky pirates renaissance like i can go with musketeers uh i can go with with all sorts of stuff wow uh snake archers were just goddamn awful what what if we would go with like archers because i honestly have zero freaking idea what this tribe of tree people or tree monkeys or what am i supposed to call these guys is all about so like considering how many of the shield bearers they have i don't know if they will remain on top of the goddamn trees or not so for the hell of it let, let's go with the medieval era maybe, maybe the the boost in the technology will give us the upper hand i really don't know what the hell to expect here we're gonna go with two healers, two, and we can theoretically put in a knight. And I don't know what what else would like theoretically work for us. I, I really did not think that like going with mammoths would would uh, be the best option here. So, not sure. Let's let let let's see what what's gonna happen. Why the hell am I so freaking far away from everyone? The the camera control, I cannot get used to that. Okay, so majority of them died because they fell off the tree. So our knight is going at it with the chieftains. The chieftains are being bombarded by barrages of arrows. Okay, that clubman got totally annihilated. The two healers over there. And that last arrow to the chest. Or to the shoulder, actually. Well, okay. We have heard of Achilles' heel. I'm not really sure if this would have some different name. Okay, so the last time we actually did this, they had a ton of reinforcements inside of the goddamn uh field so I, I was thinking maybe we can go with like the hop leads or hop lights and we would put in like medieval archers along with them for a support we have 3100 points to spend so these guys actually did kick my ass quite seriously back when i did the first episode so like le le let's see Or, so the archers might struggle with these idiots in the haystack. They they look like uh, a armor uh, against the ranged attacks. They are holding the line so far. Yeah, they they were definitely outnumbered by. Yeah, they they are definitely gonna win this. Our archers do not stand a chance here. Okay, okay, that, that's fine. So maybe archers are not the right choice. Maybe we just need to go with... Lenny of melee combatants. I don't know, let's see what the squires will do. I swear to God, they look like the Teutonic Knights. 
And I really wish the goddamn message used E and Q to move up and down would get the hell out of the screen. Because it, it's just freaking annoying me. Okay, I, I somehow, uh, like, seriously, can I get rid of this goddamn message? Because it's almost impossible then to take, like, a freaking snapshot of this thing. I don't see an option for that. So it's gonna be super difficult for me to come up with, like, a thumbnail when this goddamn thing is always there. Damn. These guys with the pitchforks are seriously no joke. But I think I found the wall can chop them all down to bits and pieces. Damn! A sword to the face! A sword to the face! Is this guy dead or is he just like stuck doing god knows what to this dude in the haystack? All right, what do we have here? Man, I really wish there would be like some sort of fire attack or something. So we have to deal with the bridge. Um, actually, uh, even if I would go with like the medieval or, or like the prehistoric or tribal thing, I, I think we would be able to win this. Um, Stoners <laughs> are obviously not the best choice for a ranged option when they have the haystack to protect them. Uh, so maybe the potion sellers because they can poison everyone. And let, let's go with like the harvesters. Well, let's see what 10 units will do. Okay, so the poison is being thrown. They, they have like extremely short reload, so like they will poison freaking everyone, including our guys with the scythe. You see, our guys are being actually hit by friendly fire. So I'm not really sure if I even needed them. <laughs> this is just the weirdest thing. And maybe they will walk off the cliff again. Yeah, boy. <laughs> So I'm not really sure if I'm doing this like incorrectly and if by like trying to find an actual strategy which would work to defeat the enemy is what I should be trying to focus upon. Like maybe I should be trying to focus upon, I don't know, uh, so some goofy way to defeat this. Okay, so here we have actually an interesting scenario. God love the statue. Uh, so we have these two idiots who are like uh, brawlers. Uh, trying to uh, figure, yeah, the the head butters. That that's who they are, I I think. So I'm I'm trying to like wonder who we can afford for one hundred bucks. One squire. Let's see what, what you can do here. Well, where, where are you going? Wait, why are they on top of a goddamn building? Ooh, wow. Are we gonna have some elevated uh, battle? What the hell is going on right now? I, I think either party is lost. Okay. This literally looks like violence against children. <laughs> what the hell did I just witness? <laughs> that was just so freaking weird. Ah, oh, okay, so we have a crap ton of these idiots now. Uh, Chronomancer. What, what do you do, man? Dude, look at this. This is like some weird god or something. Sacred Elephant. Damn, look at that. Okay. Evil Void Monarch. Jesus Christ, look at this guy. Looks like we are sending Saruman himself against a bunch of. <laughs> what the hell was that? Oh my god, this is like when Illidan changes form when he reaches the the sixth level in uh, Warcraft 3 or something. Like, <laughs> he just transmutated into this goddamn beast with the wings. And, <laughs> and everyone died because 
<laughs> I'm so confused. Oh, wow. Okay, so we have to deal with bards only? What? Okay, I think it would be actually really funny if we can get the potion throwers. Damn it, I cannot get the potion throwers. This is bad because this means that if we cannot poison them so that they like walk off the cliff, we need to look for some sort of alternative as to what might kick their butts. Um, we can go with theoretically one bone mage and, and see if he's going to be able to like use the the bones which like pop out of the ground in order to blow them out of the air or out of the ground and into the water. That is if he won't do something extremely idiotic, like kill himself. Don't kill yourself. Okay, they're actually falling into the water. Does this mean that they lose? Yeah, he killed himself. That That's awesome. That That's exactly what you want to see. Uh, I guess three squires? Maybe they are just not fans of this band? I mean, who would be? They, there's like 20 guys playing the same instrument. That's no fun. And they are taking a deep dive. I think they are actually drowning in the water. Uh, are my own guys trying to battle with themselves? I, I think my own guy is gonna drop. Awesome. Okay, why, why are you two hitting yourselves with, with these swords? There's one more little dude here hidden. Okay. It was just really weird setting. Okay, now we're cooking. Look at all these bone mages. So the funniest thing is that actually if one behind would use up his ability, he can theoretically with friendly fire eliminate the uh, friendlies. So what would happen if we would go crazy with like the potion sellers? Would they get close even enough to use their ability on our units there? You see the barrage of these potions is just ridiculous and they have reloaded. Okay, they are still going in the right direction, like they are not giving up, but I think I made it just too damn easy for myself. Like, this is not funny. Like, let's, let's try something, I don't know. Ooh, what would happen if we would go with like two mammoths? Look at these boys. Oh my god, they're so cute. They're so cute. With those goofy eyes. Let's see if we get some friendly fire. Okay, they did not even have that much chance to fire their ability as our mammoths are just stomping all over them. <laughs> oh my god, it looks like they're battling each other. <laughs> Look at this poor fellow. He, he got squished by the love of the two mammoths. I think this is much more funnier victory. Okay, what is this one goofball doing up there? Uh, 90 is too much. 140. 50 for a painter? I don't even want to know what a painter does. Ooh, skeletal warrior is 80, however. Damn. I don't know what a peasant does. These are all locked up. Um, okay, let's go mano y mano. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Horrible aim. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, and now what? And now, <laughs> no! <laughs> he fell and he broke his knee. Or, or something and that's why blue won oh come on it's some bs okay hold on we're gonna win it this time oh god damn we just got gate owed oh man oh man okay bone missed they both fell and 
I got like two achievements for this. A <laughs> peacemaker and mirror match. <laughs> it was just so weird. We we won only thanks to the simple fact that the enemy fell to the ground earlier. So I definitely see them like hidden in the haystack or, or just in the tall grass. So uh, there is a lot of them. And uh, I don't know. Sh should we try like some of these fellas with combination of archers okay wow we are actually like really surrounded archers are actually pretty damn accurate this looks like the 300 where they are just smooched in a really tiny spot and the the, the spearmen are just having a blast taking them apart okay Archers are clearing out the last remaining survivors. It, oh my god, don't don't grab him by his chunk and drag him to his buddies. That's so freaking nasty. <laughs> Can you imagine if someone would start yelling in the middle of battlefield? He touched my wiener! Like <laughs> that would be just so weird. Like what the hell have we just witnessed here? Okay, okay, wow, so we have like a multi-generational situation going on in here. Clubber, Pikeman, Squire, the, the Roman Legionnaire, which I honestly don't even know. Oh yeah, these are probably them, right? Yep, the shield bearers in, in, which? Oh yeah, we are in the ancient times. Okay, 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 I see what you did there. Well, what's the, like, why are these... Of a different size. Uh, oh, okay, so it's like actually if real people would be included. Like there are height differences between us. Okay, I can live with that. Okay, we cannot go with Minotaur, which sucks. Minotaurs are lots of fun. Um, but do we want to go with a Berserker? Valkyrie. Wow, okay. Whoa, whoa, what is up with this lady? She like she is really struggling to keep her balance. Um Yarl. Wow, we can get this dude. He is actually quite the menace. Well, let's see what happens. But can he activate his ability? Damn, he can. Now he's in the full-on rage mode. He's in this arena. Look at him just 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 annihilating everyone with that massive axe. Oh man, he he almost survived. <laughs> Two guys and he would have won. That is so awesome. I bet he can actually win this if, if we try again. Damn, like literally they are flying all over. Damn, he is just not messing around. You see? You see? <laughs> what did I tell <laughs> Even he is surprised! Like, how the hell did I just win this? <laughs> how am I still alive? <laughs> oh, man! Okay. Oh, damn, that's a lot of berserkers. And of multiple eras. I do wonder if we can actually try to replicate this. So, one, two, three, four five six seven and then we need to go into like the viking era and get the berserker one two three one one yeah we we cannot get the full number here oh my god look at him jumping at each other oh my god he's like fighting at whatever is behind him how the hell did we manage to get to an equal number with, with like less you <laughs> he almost won we almost had it uh, what what if we try the berserkers or the chieftains and and we like put them in in some sort of formation like what happens if we try this like they're gonna charge in, they're gonna get 
beaten. And then we have to deal with the stragglers. We have two chieftains left. Yeah, no. It did not work like this. So what would be like a fun thing? Like, look, if I go with the potion sellers, it's just gonna be weird. They're gonna get all poisoned, but they're gonna start closing in the distance anyhow. So we are definitely losing this. Okay, okay, okay. Let, let's try something... Like more orthodox, maybe? Let's see what these fellas will be able to pull off here. Okay, our shield wall has been effectively broken. They are able to jump towards our archers, which is quite bad. Because at that range, our archers are absolutely unusable. Our hop lead is here stuck against our archer. And I'm not sure if this guy is still alive trying to like shove that spear up his butt or something. But okay. It, this 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 did work it was really weird as a battle but okay i'll take it do we have to go another mano -y mano let's do it bitch see what you got <laughs> that was just horrible that that bastard is dabbing while he killed our guy look at that he's dabbing son of a gun okay let's try this again come on bitch Oh, come on! What is wrong with you? You can do it! You can do it! Yeah, we are dead. No, we we won! Oh, okay. I see what you did there. Okay, that that's a lot of guys for, like, getting the harvest done. What would be, like, a fun thing to theoretically sort caster? Oh, wow. That looks so weird. Ooh, what does a Reaper do? What does a Reaper do? Jesus, look at that. You know, we do have a Scythe too, so let's go with three of these bastards. Okay, I would be probably scared shitless at this point. Holy fudge. What the hell is that? <laughs> God damn it. We we got defeated, however. I don't understand how. It looked like we were kicking so much ass. I'm so confused with this. I'm so confused with this. Okay, let, let's do the skeletal warriors and skeletal archers. Just, just ooh, what do you do? I wanna know. Ooh, we can have vampire. And let, let's do the sword casting dum dum. No, hold on. Wrong. Oh my god, these skeletal archers have actually flaming arrows. Why did we not learn of this before? I, I think I have just way too many units now. You see, they are being lit on fire. So, theoretically speaking, if we would come across those guys in the haystack and we can get the flaming archers here. I think we can actually deal quite the damage. This, this dude is just spamming those swords. He's like a freaking John Wick with swords. That's ridiculous. Oh yeah, approach the, the guy with the sights. I definitely want to see what the flaming archers would do to... Uh, an enemy who we have to deal with like this. Okay, so we have them. And I know that, uh, for example, the... The knights or, or the kings uh, do tend to win against them. So if we would go with like a king and knight and some healers... We might have a chance here. It's not guaranteed, though. It's not guaranteed. But... Yeah, we're actually kicking ass. Look at that guy. He's waving to the rest of his platoon. Like, hey guys, I'm just chilling up here. I think we are gonna win this. 
If the king falls, we are boned because the healers will then just start healing themselves and uh, it's just a game over. Come on, defeat the last one. Yeah, that was brutal. That was like Game of Thrones brutal. I think we have to go for another one of these dum-dums. Um, actually, we can directly try a spear thrower. <laughs> yeah, take that, bitch. Stone Age got you. <laughs> um, okay, this is interesting. So I think there's like an easy way to deal with this. Oh, let, let's go with Minotaurs. Minotaurs are awesome. They, they just freaking charge and then they keep kicking butt. But they do have a king, so I don't think this is a, a viable strategy here. After that initial charge, uh, the Minotaurs just lose their momentum. And those swings from the king's sword are just too damn much for us to handle. Okay, but that that was really fun. I, I don't want to do like ballista or something. These are just really stupid things. Ah, uh, ooh, a dynamite thrower. Let's see what these fellows can do. Oh damn! <laughs> well, we definitely didn't blow ourselves up. So not the best option. Uh, theoretically, if we would put these two dum-dums over here, and I don't know, like going ranged against these idiots is probably not the best strategy. Mammoth is just gonna have a blast here. And those dynamite sticks, they are there just for decoration. <laughs> Look at this mammoth squishing everyone with its love or ass. <laughs> Depending on which end you get. <laughs> yeah, the king does not like that. Who's it gonna be? Ah, damn it, he did get the... the... Oh my god, he missed. But yeah, definitely losing this. Okay, so... Uh, this was fun idea, but I think what we need are bone mages. They they just simply know how to do this. Yeah. Wow, these are like some skeletal dudes. Don't kill yourself. Come on, go after the king. Kick, kick his ass. Use your weird ability and, and, and do whatever it is that you do. Yeah, that king is definitely gonna kick our ass. Okay, okay. Interesting. Um, could theoretically try this. I'm not really sure how much of an effect it's gonna have. I mean, the projectiles or the shields are not really gonna protect them from the effects of the potion. So they're just gonna get really poisoned and get a horrible hangover. But the king is just going strong. He is refusing to sit the hell down. Sit down. Sit down. Come on, you're not feeling right. Look at the barrage of these potions. And he is still standing. That is one strong freaking king. Uh, until he freaking falls into the, the smallest pond in the land. And he just drowns in this tiny ass creek. You mean that the funniest thing ever? Okay, the issue here is I, I don't know uh, which ones from all these corpses are still like alive. Damn, these are just healers for one cleric? Why? Like, I, I don't understand. Ooh, we can go with dragons. Oh, that's not exactly what I expected to see. A monkey king. Let's see a monkey king! Man, this, this squire is gonna have one difficult time dealing with a monkey king. 
uh, unless we get our ass whooped. What just happened there? Oh my god, look at him go. Damn, he's just whooping ass. Yeah, the, the healer is in this much of a high number, totally pointless. Look at that. Look at it. He's like, I kicked some serious ass today. Oh, yeah. These are going to be annoying to deal with. Ah. Uh, Stoner. That's still the funniest name ever. Um. I don't know. Like, Mad Mechanic? Damn. Shadow Walker. Interesting. Uh. Renaissance. We we have not tried this. Let, let's go with Musketeers. I'm betting they're gonna have just the worst reload time ever. What's a Balloon Archer for Christ's sake? Let's go with some Fencers and let's piss them off by giving them something to actually try and focus. Okay, they're activating their abilities. I'm so confused with these balloons. Oh, so it's like it hits the enemy, the balloon like... ...expands and then what, well, it carries the body into like the heights or something? I I'm so confused with this. And we're definitely not gonna win this like this. Okay, okay, okay. So this is like a w worthwhile attempt to at least see what the hell are these things up to. Um, I want to see what the hell do the Valkyries do. Like, let's get eight of them and let's see them. Ooh, so they swoop in. And I'm assuming that if they lose their wings, that means the Valkyrie is dead. Wow, they, they have absolutely horrible resistance to damage whatsoever. Not really great. Um, berserkers? It's not good to like pile them up so close because then they activate the abilities. And we just uh, like receive way too much damage there. Okay. Horrible, horrible idea. Right, let's try this guy again. Deathbringer. Man, that sounds cool. Let's try him. Let's see what do they do. I, I don't understand these effects. It, it looks so freaking weird. Okay, one of them is dead and one is going mano in mano with, with the bear dude. But we got our asses handed to us. Uh, pirate. We haven't tried that yet. A pirate queen. Wow, an angry woman. Uh, probably no. Uh, what if we try something like a mammoth and a uh, bunch of chieftains? And of course, you're gonna rush against the the single dude with, with the scythe and, and you cannot even like sit down on top of him or something come on impress me beautiful hit beautiful but i don't think the mammoth will be able to withstand the damage output okay so if we go with a king of our own and if we go with the two jarls we cannot go even with the two jarls we can go with two Jarls and uh, we can put in some of them and let's go with a head butter just for a good measure. Okay. So far I cannot tell who, who's the winner in the initial engagement. It's, it's like all over the place. I, I think we are losing this fight specifically. Why are you laying down? You just got your ass chopped, so now you have like three cheeks. 
Why was he on on the floor? What the hell happened there? Okay. Uh I'm like trying a mix of all sorts of things. Might work, might not work. Who am I to know? Let's go with two freaking knights. 15 units of total mass. Yeah, this is not gonna end well. Once he activates the ability, our units get all effed up. I think we lost our two knights just from the initial attack. So I would have to like spread these knights out like so. Why are you hitting your own units? No, don't be all three in one location. Yeah, that ability is definitely something annoying. We're so losing this, I can tell you that right now. The knight is still somehow alive, but no longer. Okay, is someone gonna go after that one Jarl down there? I just simply don't have enough poison to deal with the king. There has to be something else. Okay. Uh, what if we try like two kings, two healers for each king, and one, two, three, four. No! What the hell? Don't abandon the one king on top. Well, don't do that. That's such a dick move. Okay, okay, fun stuff is happening. I don't think we're gonna survive. He just totally missed. Yeah, two versus one. Not really good. Uh, is he alive or dead? I think he's dead. Okay, so we almost got it. Um... Uh, let's try wh whatever just so that they are distracted. Why are these freaking medics always abandoning one of these kings? Like what the actual F? What what is up with that? Like like then this dude is stuck going against like four units or so. And then he just simply cannot stand a chance. Okay, we should definitely win it this time. Unless the bard is gonna F it up for us somehow. Let's blame it on the musician. Oh, come on. You gotta kill the last guy. Finally. And again. Okay. We do want- Damn it, we cannot go with a spirit thrower this time. That sucks! Uh, farmer, hay bearer. Oh, man. Uh. Samurai, painter, flintlock! Well, let's try that. Well, bam! Did he drop his two pistols? Oh, we are so gonna lose this. He's gonna get a sword to the face. Unless he's gonna die from that fall. Look at this. He's just... If he's gonna win this, I'm gonna be loud. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. He seriously won it. I mean, the guy had a freak. King sword to a knuckle fight. Oh man. Oh man. Okay, th this is just uh weird. Oh uh, man. What what do we want to put against this? Pumpkin catapult. 
Like, what's the worst thing that can happen here? Like, can they, like... Beat the, the catapult to death with, with the musical instrument? Th this is just the weirdest match ever. Like, why are you making me go through this? Why are you choosing a single target when there's like five of these idiots next to one another? Why do you hate me so much? This is horrible. I I'm not liking that. Uh, we have 1,000 in our budget. Let's go with a long ship. Let let's see what the hell is gonna happen. <clears throat> Did he just toss the ship on top of his dumb ass? And now with these paddles, they're gonna spank some ass. Look at that. Yeah, that's it. Spank him. Don't, don't freaking drown, you dumbass. I'm so confused with this. Okay. Uh, ooh, let's do samurais. Let's just see what these proficient fighters with a sword can do against these idiots. Toss a coin to your samurai and he's gonna chop your ass up. Okay, everyone's running. The tactical retreat is real here. Don't, don't you dare drop down that cliff. You can, all of you can. Definitely go for it, go nuts. What, what's that one dude doing over there? Why are you fighting the wall? Just, just... Oh my god. Oh, fuck, did he hit him or what? what? I feel like I'm missing all the other stuff, but this is just so damn fun. He, he simply cannot hit the board. He's totally off the beat. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Look at that. That's a lot of catapults. We're gonna need something which can close in the distance rather fast. Or... Ooh, Da Vinci tank! Let's try that! Let's try that! Let's see what happens. Damn, it's, it's so far holding. It did take quite a lot of shots. We're not gonna be able to close that distance in, huh? Okay, we did manage to actually fire a couple of times, but our tank got totally shot to bits. Uh, man, that, that was interesting. Ooh, let's try these things. This can be fun. Look at all these fire arrows. Oh my god, I think we have one. No, there's still two catapults left. That is so awesome. That is so awesome. This is where rockets started. They used a small charge to propel the arrow and they had so many of them because the accuracy was just non-existent. That was awesome. That, that was just so much fun. Okay, so I have no freaking idea what's gonna be coming out of that cave. Surgically, we can try to replicate the process. Are you just gonna shoot inside of the cave? <laughs> Why are you going to the entrance, you dumbass? Don't, don't do that. Oh my god, that's horrible. That's like a massacre. Look at this. <gasps> they are just being totally annihilated. We're turning them into shish kebabs. <laughs> this, this last... Oh my god, he's gonna win. He's gonna win. Oh man. You see that? Like, he... Oh my god, uh, like, like an 
ankle shot or, or got him but everything else dot okay well this one would go into like his thigh and maybe one of these would hit like his uh, uh willy but oh man that was brutal oh okay 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 oh uh, i want i want to see if we can again like try fireworks archer why the hell not What did I just see? What was that? What just happened? Oh, you're so gonna lose. Oh, man. That was so funny. Okay, hold on. I bet we can win this. Again. So our guy is gonna follow down. Uh, I hope he can load that arrow. Oh my god, how the hell did we lose? He he fired the arrow. I don't get it. Okay, let's try something else. Uh, a fencer. A flintlock. He's gonna... Ooh! Blunderboss. Let's try this. That's some serious knockback from that weapon. <laughs> oh my god, we have one because he went face first into concrete. That is so freaking wicked. Oh my god. Oh, holy fucksicle. We are just surrounded here. Is that even, like, allowed? What the hell am I supposed to do with this? Uh... Oh, let's do the Da Vinci tank! Look at it go! Oh my god, if this thing would be spinning so much, I would be throwing up like crazy inside. Like, just, just the cannons spinning are enough to deal damage to these squires. This is the worst fair attraction I have ever seen in my life. Who's getting sick? Who's getting sick? <laughs> oh my god, it's working! I cannot believe it! <laughs> god damn it, that's so weird. Oh my god, this one guy inside must have the worst job ever. Worst job ever. Oh damn. Four mammoths? Can, can we deal with that? Look, oh my god, no. A guy accidentally placed the mammoth on, on top of a building. Oh man, we are missing some money for... Aww. That sucks. Uh, can we put this over here? Like, if you stay there and just fire the arrows on, on, on the mammoths... That would be the most awesome thing ever. I don't think it's gonna work though. The mammoths are just being stuck in here. Okay, let, what if we do this, however? Because we know that the mammoths are simply stuck. But we can still close in the distance. Oh my god, we are turning these poor animals into shish kebabs. The funniest thing is, one of these mammoths, two of them are dead. Holy fudge, this actually is working. This little poor manny here is totally left alone without his saber tooth and sloth. Oh my god, we have annihilated manny from Ice Age. Fudge me. How the hell are we gonna deal with this thing? Oh my god, I did not know we can put down the units like this. <laughs> what just happened? Oh man, our units totally fell apart. How is this catapult still functional? Oh my god. 
Oh, a cannon. Is this cheating? Yeah, the cannons are just falling down from the rooftops. I, I don't know if we can like... There's two cannons left and two catapults left. This guy is actually trying to go with the uh, cannon towards the catapults. Bomb thrower. Yeah, let, let's try something simpler. Since they have the high ground. Like the catapults are just sliding off the surface. Um, we need to make sure we can somehow get over there, but it, it's like not guaranteed. What about harpooners? Can they like drag down? Oh my god, they can actually like drag it down. Okay, now we're cooking maybe. Well, he did the harpoon the catapult, but it's just freaking stuck there. The, the cannon is just literally falling like off the stairs and firing up words. Okay, this was the weirdest match so far. Oh man, okay, okay. What do we have that we can theoretically use here? Because this idiot is gonna toss himself at our unit. Let's try a new- Oh my god, he just jumped into the wall. Come on, turn around. It's not the right time to be pacifist or whatever you're into. Yeah, that's it. Whoop his ass. Whoop, whoop his ass. Damn. Damn. Back of his head. Nice. Okay, what the hell? Oh, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. I want to try. The archers. As many as possible. 41. Flaming archers. <laughs> We're getting obliterated here. I wanted to see what would happen if the fire arrows would hit actually this guy. But nobody, like, tried to even touch him. Okay, so... Wheelbarrows are what they are using. They have... Eight of them. I cannot afford that many of them. So we need to try... This has become, like, my new favorite toy ever. Oh my god, they're just buried in arrows. Yeah, we're not gonna win this. Oh man. Well, let's try these dragons. Like, what the hell do these dudes do? We can get seven of them. Oh man, look at that. We're actually killing our own guys with, with the dragons in the back. And they are flying! Oh my god, they're flying! That's so awesome! Oh man, how long is this campaign? This is insane! Um, uh, I don't even know what the hell to try now. Jouster. Oh, wow. Well, let's go with, like, real knights. <laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> oh, my... Oh, no! We lost one! Oh, the pony fell into the water! And he drowned! That's so sad! <laughs> he got knocked the hell off his horse! <laughs> Man, what is up with this pony? Oh man. Okay, uh, that 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 was funny. That was some funny stuff. Oh man, 
what what do gunslingers do? Jesus, how many guns do you carry? Let's try. Oh my god! What the hell is that for an attack? You shoot the bullets up in the air and then you wait for them to... That is extremely inefficient strategy, man. A quick draw. Let's see what's up. Yeah, those shields are definitely able to withstand any ranged attack we throw at them. Let's try these things. L let's see how many arrows can they actually withstand. Damn. Okay. So oh my god, look at those arrows. We might actually win this. We are gonna win this. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Oh man, I wanna see the the uh, fire skeletons. Or the, the skeleton archers. Just, just like towards these dumbasses. Come on, come on. Are, are, are they gonna be burning up? Why aren't you lit on fire? I mean, you have a literal stack on top of you. You should be flaming hot Cheeto by now. This is some BS. Ah, uh, I call BS. They should be like seriously struggling there. About if this is just about like a tiny, tiny spot from which they keep on coming. Let's try to make it difficult for them. Don't abandon that tiny, tiny spot over there. Yeah, they, they are just totally effing them up. Totally annihilated. Oh my god, if these idiots are gonna walk down that cliff, I'm gonna be mad. A spear to the face! Spear to the face. Nice. Oh wow, we're still not done. Okay. Um. Uh, I just don't know at this range, like... Oh, well, let's, let's go with him. Well, let's see who will win this. <laughs> oh man, okay, okay. Ooh, let, let's try this because we will be, I don't know, maybe closer or something. We will initiate the attack. Damn it, what the hell? Why do we have the delay always? Okay. Ooh, fun idea. Ah, that did not help. That did not help. Okay. Oh, what about an archer? <laughs> okay. Accountant, achievement. Yeah, somehow I actually got an achievement apparently that like only 2.4% people were able to get before for not converting enemy units. I, I don't know. I don't know. At this point, I just don't know, man. This will be just too, too damn brutal, right? Yeah, whoever is in the center mass, they're not gonna have the best time. I think we're gonna see some friendly fire there. Wow, one of our is still alive. Yeah, the friendly fire, totally, totally. Damn. All the archers. So what would happen if we would have all the protectors? 
Arcade Bearers. Shield Bearers. Brawlers. I'm trying to look for anything which would resemble like uh, having to carry a shield but I don't know if the hay bearer does count let's just go with like a massive roman legion with shields just see what the hell will happen here Okay, some of the shields actually got pierced. This is gonna be bad if they actually show their side to the archers. It might expose them to the deadly attack. It looks like we are just in like a massive mosh bed during like a Slipknot concert or something. This is not a really viable strategy there. Therefore, we're gonna have to try something different. I don't know what. Well, let's try these idiots. Because they are fast. <laughs> they just might be able to deal enough damage. <laughs> oh man, it's working! It's working! The snakes are unable to get the, the wheelbarrows. <laughs> this is such a mess. Oh man. Oh my god, okay, okay, you know what? We're gonna like cut it off here because this has been going on for like an hour. I have no idea how much of this stuff have I already covered. Oh yeah, we, we got like almost to the half of it, so maybe on the next episode we can proceed with the campaign. That is depending on your views, and if you actually did enjoy the previous two episodes, this means the previous one and this one. And if you want to see more tabs, let me know in the comment section or give the episode a like. And if you want to know what the channel is currently up to, consider subscribing as I publish fun content like this on a weekly base. I do playthroughs, comparisons, guides, reviews, all sorts of cool stuff. Link is in the description. Go check it out. I'm going to wish you a pleasant rest of the day and hopefully I will see you at the next one. Thank you for watching everyone. Stay safe out there in the meantime and bye bye for now. And this was so weird. <laughs>